everybody, I'm asked all the time, can the wrong exercise make you gain weight? And the answer is yes. Now, nine times out of 10, we are thinking and told that we need to do more cardio when we're not losing weight. But the problem is we're not doing it right. We are pushing ourselves to the limit, doing two a days, checking out those thousand calorie burn workouts, and they're wearing us down. Because as you get over 40, you need more recovery and you need to do your cardio strategically. This is where not enough conditioning comes in. So with conditioning, this is doing cardio strategically, helping your heart to manage stress more effectively and metabolism more effectively. It's training your metabolism. When you get your heart rate between the 140 and 160 zone, you are helping your body create more mitochondria, more of those little factors, your aerobic engines, those little factories to help you make energy and then boost your metabolism so that you can get the metabolic processes going. So if you are doing a lot of these excessive cardio things where you're pushing yourself to the limits day in, day out, you're not gonna get the results compared to when you're doing it strategically. So two days a week of sustained 140 to 160 heart rate exercise, bonus. So 30, 45 minutes of that with one day of doing HIT or pushing yourself with VIT, V-I-I-T, varied intensity workouts, or just straight up Tabatas. You could do that as well, but only one day a week, having recovery after it, 120 to 140, keeping it very mellow in the recovery zone that day after, the next day going in to more conditioning. This is the idea, cycling what you're doing with your cardio, not balls to the wall, same thing every single day. The other thing that is a problem with ladies is a lot of times we'll get in the gym, we'll get on the machine and we'll read a book and just go on the machine at the same pace. That's a recovery workout. You're not going to be doing any benefits for your metabolism with that. That's just helping you to recover, which is great because a lot of us don't have enough recovery, but you don't wanna do it day in, day out. You wanna make sure that you are varying your cardio, varying your conditioning. And so making sure you have variety in your workouts, strength training too, are the things that are going to help you to get that weight off or to prevent you from plateauing. So take a look at these big three things here. What's the thing that you've got going on that you can tweak, make some changes, and I bet you'll start to see some of that weight come off. All right, I'm Dr. Janine Krauss. Thanks for watching.